When Roger came to live with his grandparents, he rarely got enough to eat. But that wasn't the greatest challenge he would face. His emotions are still raw as he remembers the day his mom left. She found a boyfriend. Then she had an engagement. Then she went away. And I never saw her again. To escape his pain and his hunger, the nine-year-old spent lots of time away from the house. His grandma acknowledged how hard it's been to provide for her grandson. Some days there was nothing. I gave him the last bit of rice. Many times Roger went hungry. Then someone invited Roger to a place called The Village. It's a ministry supported by CBN's Orphan's Promise that helps some of the neediest kids in Iquitos, Peru. I had no friends to play with before. Now, here at the village, I have a million friends. Last year, CBN's Orphan's Promise not only supported the center, we also helped to expand it. Now, Monday through Friday, the kids receive lunch and a snack and are taught about the love of Jesus through CBN's Superbook programs which have now been translated into Spanish. I like it because he heals the sick and makes food come down from heaven to feed the crowds. One day after watching another episode, Roger prayed to receive Jesus as his savior and for something else. After one superbook, I asked Jesus to take the sadness away. He listened to me and made me happy. I am so happy when I see him praying. There is a great change in him. Roger likes to invite kids from his neighborhood to the Orphan's Promise Center, too. I brought three friends to the village. One of them received Jesus. I thank God for giving me a grandma and Orphan's Promise for making me a happy boy. <laughs>